Hello, I'm Kate. Hope you're okay. Sending love to everyone. This video is something a little bit different. It's a greenhouse to summer house video. So if you've been watching my videos lately or my vlogs, you would have seen little snippets of our greenhouse and what we've been getting up to. So this is the video to show you how it was before and then during and then after. So I forgot to film the intro though, which is why I'm doing this part now. So I put it all together and I was like, oh, I don't have an intro. So I start off showing what it was like, you know, before we got involved. Involved before we started the work. But before I say another word, I've got to do my mug of the day, which is sitting here patiently for me. I haven't used this mug for ages. I forgot, I forgot about you. I am sorry. It's probably one of the most beautiful mugs I own. I love it. And I bought it from TK Maxx probably a couple of years ago now. And it says happy. The maker's Grace's tea wear. It's just really pretty, isn't it? I love the little print design on it it's just gorgeous so I shall use you mug for the rest of the day it makes me happy that mug and it says happy so this is my mug of the day I've got some water because I was a bit thirsty so yeah that's the mug of the day so I shall stop talking I'll let you watch the video and let me know what you think as well because I don't know if I did an ending if I didn't do an ending I'll just record one and put it at the end so I hope you enjoy the video and come over to Instagram if you want to I'm Kate McCabe on Instagram and my house account is Kate's Homely Home and there's some pictures of the greenhouse as well on there so if you watch me on Instagram what if you follow me on Instagram you might have already seen some things in my stories anyway I'll let you go enjoy the video and I'll see you soon well not see you soon but I'll be in the video so I'll, I'll, I won't go anywhere I'll be in the I'll just go bye this is what it looks like at the moment so before we make any changes. I thought it was quite small, but uh, we've taken quite a lot out and it looks quite large now. So this was here when we bought the house, this greenhouse, and we haven't really used it. I think my mum and Toby bought some bird plops on there. My mum and Toby used to have some tomatoes and things, but then no one really bothered. So we're gonna make it a usable room, especially with everything going on at the moment. It's quite nice to have different zones and different areas. I love this little potting table. This was inside the greenhouse, so we're gonna do something with that. So let's go inside. At the moment, we've just got our sofa, outdoor sofa cushions in here. There's loads of cobwebs, so it needs a good clean. I think it's gonna be really nice. And we're gonna keep these shelves, I think, so we can put things on them. I don't know about this one, this bottom shelf here. Maybe, because we want a little dining table in here and just a really nice area. It's gonna be lovely. So it's quite cold where we live. It's quite windy, sorry, because we live by the sea. So it's gonna be nice to, having, to have a sheltered area. And because it's a greenhouse, it's always gonna be warm. And when it's too hot, we can just sit outside. So this is what it looks like at the moment. We've got electricity as well. I think that's a plug down there, which is great, isn't it? Okay, so this is the before, and then we'll show you the progress as we go. This looks amazing now. It's been jet washed. I did it as well. Did you? Well done. How yeah, nice does that well. look? Yeah, right. In one time I dug down to that pipe, but Did you? that would have been flat in if I wouldn't well have Well done, Toe. So you're going to brick weave in here? I did that side, I did this side. Maybe we should get rid of this. Um, yeah, and, and yeah just it. keep the look top one. Is it a bit... Oh, we can keep it and do something else with it, though. It might take up a yeah, bit too one, much please. room. So they've removed this shelf and they're just digging up all the mud. And then we've got some sand to go down. Is that right? Yeah, so we're going to put sand out. Yeah. And then we're going to brick weave from the side of this path. Make it the same. Um, then we're going to... Well, oh, Toby's working really hard, aren't you? Yeah. Well just done, Toby. We just took that out. Yeah, look. And water. We water. just took that out. And a heater. And this is the inside. They're going to start the brick weave soon. Oh. That's Lee's speaker talking to me. I thought she was telling me I'm not allowed in. It's going to be so nice having this area because it's sheltered from the elements as well. Sheltered from the elements, darling. So yeah, there's no wind in here. It's just lovely and it's a really windy day as well. Sorry, I've got my dressing gown on because it is chilly today. Yeah, so this is the latest stage of the greenhouse. I think we're going to paint in here as well. Or we might leave it actually because it's quite nice and rustic. So we might leave this as it is, but just paint the outside. We've got some sand that is coming in here. Is that just to help lay the floor? Oh, sorry. Ah. We've got that 
to the height we want it, and then we put the sand on. Yeah. And we make it level, and then we place the bricks on top of the sand. How far off are you doing that? Um, we've just got to put the sand in and get it level. So. Okay. Oh, it looks brilliant in here. Well okay. done. Well done, Tobes. How hard he's working. Oh, really mind the glass. <laughs> and Lee has just started laying the floor, so we're just putting bricks down and then going to concrete around the edge. So, is this called anything? Just brick weaving? Yeah, so this is the next stage of the greenhouse makeover. About a third of it's been finished. Looks so good. This floor looks brilliant. I and to. I know, well done. I had to get on with it. Did you? And that the outside one's levelled off. And these bricks we've reused, so they were just ones we had anyway. So we're just reusing things we've already got, which is really it's good, isn't it? Yeah, really good. This looks so, this looks brilliant. You've never done it before, have you, Lee? Can you do a little bit of painting? Yeah, we can do a bit of painting. I need to get some warmer clothes on, though. And Leah's finished this side of the bricks that had been... The edges have been pushed down and we're keeping these slabs in the middle and then I think tomorrow they're going to finish on the right hand side. It's great though, it's really flat and it's just great making use of what we already had. I can't wait to actually use this and sit in here and have it as a an outdoor room. It's so exciting. Hello, today is Saturday the 4th of April and I am joining in. I'm undercoating the outside. Lee's doing really well with the inside, doing the last bit of the floor and I thought I'd come over and help because I'm not doing another vlog today so I'm painting, so just undercoating on here. I've got my little paint pot. Toby's doing it as well. Toby's been brilliant, he's collecting bricks and then bringing them over so Lee can put them on the floor over there. I think I'm just going to carry on painting, undercoating for a little while. Hello, it's Sunday the 5th of April and it's about six o'clock in the evening and we've been doing the greenhouse all day. Well, that's a lie actually, Lee's been doing this all day and I did about two hours worth of painting on the outside so I carried on with the undercoat. And I think we're, well, we're nearly there. Lee's nearly finished the floor. There's a little bit to go there. So we didn't have the same bricks, but once there's a table there, you won't even notice he's done so well it's been such a boring job and it's looking really good i love it in here so yeah this is the this is what uh, we've been doing today so this is the progress and then all of this has been undercoated needs a bit of a clean on the inside that's what we've got to do next and we ran out of pale gray undercoat which is why it looks a bit funny so we had to use a darker gray but then once we put the proper coat on it'll be fine and it'll all get covered. So I think hopefully we can paint this tomorrow if it doesn't rain. It's the 7th of April and Lee has just been cleaning all the cobwebs. Well, not cleaning, I suppose, just trying to get the cobs, cobwebs down, did you? There's loads of cobwebs up there. Toby's preparing some sand. They are gonna put the sand in the cracks of all these bricks so they're more solid, I suppose. And then yes, we can yeah, decorate. Yeah, like oh yeah, that's what you do. So yeah, then we can decorate. Yeah. I can't wait to do the decorating bit. And we also have to paint the outside, which we'll probably get done today. So I've got to go over these. It's all been undercoated. We just need to go over with the top coat and finish it all off. So we're not sure if this is how you should do it, but it looks good, doesn't it? That should just fill all the little bits. Oh, that's a good way of doing it, look. Oh, yeah, come on. So you play around it, and yeah. you go over the edge, you put it down. Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. Mm. And we have just about finished the greenhouse. We haven't decorated it, so the floor is done. We've painted the outside. It's cleaned in here. You might remember these from a charity shop haul a while ago, maybe a year ago. So I can't wait to decorate, got a few things over here. And, oh, that was my flip-flop, I wasn't blowing off. So yeah, I can't wait to decorate it and make it look beautiful in here. And we've got a little table, hello, hello. that I'm gonna put in here. It needs a clean, so I'm just gonna clean the table, then we're gonna bring oh, it in. Table. Will you help me clean the table? Yeah, I like clean the table. Oh, can you pick that hard up that's on the floor there? Oh, yeah. Oh, no, oh yeah, thank you. So we're gonna clean the table, then bring it in. 
put some chairs around and we're going to have a barbecue in here tonight so we're getting it ready and then I'm going to finish the video and do another a separate decorating the greenhouse video so yeah there'll be yes. another video if you want to see what we do I think we're going to hang stuff and maybe put some material on the ceiling on the roof so that'll be a separate video but just got to quickly clean the table that was my flip-flop again making front noises huh. Um, yeah, clean the table, then we're going to just quickly shove it in here, and then it is time to go. And I've just put this little table in here for now, and a couple of our old chairs, and I painted that little table down there and plonked a couple of lanterns on. Toby put a few decorations around, he put one over there as well, I've got a little radio there that I listen to, we've had that on pretty much all day every day so yeah this is what the greenhouse looks like so i hope you enjoyed this video of our greenhouse into a summer house there's still loads to do we've got to sort out some of the wires and you know decorate it i'm going to enjoy a few gins tonight after all that painting so thanks for watching if you did enjoy the video give it a like and if you haven't subscribed then make sure you do and i will speak to you again tomorrow morning at eight o'clock so a video every day for as long as we are in and everything is a little bit unsettled i will be here every day at eight in the morning so hit the notification bell thing as well because just in case so thanks for watching stay safe stay at home sending lots of love to everyone and i'll speak to you soon and in the meantime come over to instagram my house account is kate's homely home i also documented our progress on there in the stories highlight and kate mccabe is my other account they'll be linked in the description below with some other housey videos and ones I've done lately. So thanks for watching. Speak to you soon. Bye.